Hello everyone, it's Lurgs. Welcome to my channel. I'm here to save you time and money. And today is how to remove the dispenser drawer on a Beko washing machine. This is the Beko washing machine here and this is the dispensing drawer that we're going to be removing. Now the reason we want to remove the dispenser drawer and give it a good clean is because when you're doing a wash you do not want all the mould and gunk going down into the wash and mixing in with all your clothes. And before we get started, there's a link above now about how to install a brand new washing machine. This is the model here, but all Beko washing machines should be very similar. So what you do is you literally just pull the dispenser drawer out, but don't pull it too hard. And then it reaches a point where it just stops. Now to actually remove the entire thing, what you need to do is push down hard on this button here. So just push it down hard as you're pulling it out and that just releases a small clip and there we go, it's now been released. While you've got this dispenser drawer out, it's definitely worth cleaning the inside here. This one is actually not too bad, but I'll just show you what happened on my previous washing machine. So this was really filthy, full of gunk and washing powder and conditioner. So just get a cloth in there and some kitchen towel just give that a good old scrub. Don't be tempted to use a toothbrush in here because if that falls down, it could get inside the washing machine and damage it. So take your Beko dispensing drawer, give that a good clean. And the way I do that is just to borrow my wife's toothbrush, use some hot soapy water and just give it a good scrub inside and out. Now the Beko washing machine dispenser drawer that we took out was actually in really good condition. So I'm just going to show you an example of one which can be absolutely filthy dirty and just showing you how to give it a good old clean. And there's a link above now to a playlist for all sorts of tips and tricks and how to's on all sorts of various different washing machines. It's definitely worth checking that out. Once you've given the Beko dispensing drawer a good old clean, then you can just slide it back in. Now it's exactly the same way to get it back in. You need to just push that button down and push it in so it goes past the clip and then slide it all the way home. And there we go. Oh, and there's one thing that I've forgotten to tell you. You need to put your wife's toothbrush back. Actually, I lie, I didn't use my wife's toothbrush. I used my girlfriend's toothbrush. <laughs> and now it's time for a lovely cup of tea. If you would like more how-to tips on how to save time and money, then please subscribe by pressing this button down here. And if you'd like to select any other videos around here, that would be really cool. I really do appreciate you checking out my channel.